How to dial in your grinder. You will need some fresh coffee beans, scales, portafilla, tamper, and obviously your machine and grinder. So firstly, you want to weigh the amount of grind you're putting into the extraction. So you can consistently control the amount without adding any unwanted variables. Say you're putting 20 grams in, you want 40 grams out of the extraction. Usually you want a ratio of about one to two. However, if you are following a coffee recipe, they will usually tell you how much specifically to put in and out, which we will get back to in a bit. When extracting, you want the espresso to look like honey off a spoon. If it's too runny, you'll have to make the grind more fine. If the espresso is coming out in drops, you will need to make the grind more coarse. Repeat this process until you get the perfect honey-like consistency. The dialed in sweet spot for my grinder was here. For your grinder, it will be slightly different. But here are some examples of other grinder sweet spots. Note, if you are following a recipe, the amount of time needed will also be specified. This will also help you dial your grind in. You'll also want to follow the recipe closely, as that will usually lead to the best tasting results. Important tips. Each time you adjust your grind size, you will need to purge the grinder as there is distance between the burrs and the nozzle where the grind needs to come out of before you can get the adjusted amount. Failing to do this can give you misleading results. You also want to make sure you're tamping at a consistent pressure to make sure you aren't changing the amount of work the water will need to do to pass through the grind. Now you should have a perfectly dialed in grinder. For more tips and guides, follow Departure on TikTok and Instagram, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.